What's going to do, you know what it is, you know what it isn't, your boy Agar, back with another reaction video. Before we get into this, you know what to do, lock on me on kick. You know how to do it on us, we are in the kick. We are about to react to this. This is my first time reacting to Quadeca. I've been seeing this all over my comments. It's just, it's just you guys, and you guys did what you had to do, and now we're here, all right? So, uh, let's just get right into it. Dust Cutter. Never heard do it ever in my life. Skipping songs I don't like that. Only because it's the first time. How did we get here? How did we get here? A la carte day. A la carte. My feature and break Let's see. My favorite poem was the one I read to you. Okay. The teleprompter on the tongue of my shoe. Okay. A flashback, so I touch more resolute. Declaring thumb words in the pocket of my soul. Take it. Take it all down, take me all apart You can have my tongue, just promise you'll take it all apart Take it all, just don't take it all to heart Thank God we turn the lights on Thank God, uh, take it, uh, take me all apart You can have my tongue, just promise you'll take it all apart Take it all, just don't take it all to heart Thank God we turn the lights on What I couldn't say to you A joke that wasn't funny cause it's true A flashback so I touch more resolute So forgive me for the hesitant salute <laughs> Take it, take it all down, take me all apart You can have my tongue if you take it all apart Take it off, just don't take it all to heart Thank God we turn the lights off Thank God uh, And what I never knew I'd rather 
go mad. Cart definitely had a little more uh, uh, definitely gave a lot more for me to grab onto when it comes in terms of like where this album is going because I really don't know where I'm going I feel like I'm on this rope swinging and I just don't know where it's gonna like you know where I'm gonna end up I'm just I'm still falling you know I'm still falling uh, I don't know where I'm going with this let's see pretty privilege <laughs>
feel like this is an album where I can hear. If I feel like now nah, I know we got break it's on here. Uh, you know what? I ain't gonna say anything. I'm free. I'm free songs. <laughs> I haven't skipped anything yet. I'm too busy trying to process what exactly is going on. Yeah. Nice little sentimental vibe right there, you know? I feel like we're getting somewhere now. Even if I try up next, let's see what's up now. Yeah, if I should, I should it down. I've never heard beats like these before. Yeah, if I should, I should it down. I swear I won't miss. 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 Even if I tried, I couldn't miss. Miss. Even if I tried, I'll tell you this I swear to God, if I want, then I really will barely exist mm -hmm. Yeah, I swear to God, if I'm not, then I thought you would know who it is mm -hmm. This is even if I lie, you know who it is This is even if I, I'm convinced When it all comes crashing down, I can't resist Tears, if you try to cover it up, it'll all eclipse Clips, this close to the tipping point of my fingertips Tips, better listen up and do what I Oh! <laughs> 
This album sounds like if Wyland worked with JPEG Mafia. All right, back to not knowing what the fuck I'm listening to. I mean, don't get me wrong. These songs are great white noise. As I sit here and eat my dinner and vibe out in my, you know, in the crib. I'm definitely, you know, in a good space. You know, this, this album is definitely making me feel good. So I guess in terms of, you know, the album... In terms of how the album makes me feel, I guess it's good. But it's definitely not what I'm used to. <clears throat> not at all. <clears throat> Choking on a piece of rice here. It's a light in a room with a multicolored ceiling It's like white on the shoes with the multicolored crease And it's just like the truth with the multicolored meaning
mixed feelings about that song. At times it was like, you know, suspenseful because it was just calm. And then it would get like this little bridge, a little break in it, in the beat. And then it would just, you know, the beat just drops. And did that a couple songs. It did that a couple times on his album. But, um, yeah, I still don't know what to think of it. Like, I'm not, I'm naturally trying to fall into, like, where I'm supposed to be getting, you know, but I'm having a hard time. I just did that callback. Like what they're doing with this auto tune. See, that's interesting and ear grabbing to me. You know what I'm saying? I like that. I like that. You don't know me like that. I like the I like, you know, the way he was saying, you don't know me like that. Feel me? It was kind of giving. All right, let's see how I make it look effortless. I make it look effortless. I make it look effortless. I don't need to preface it. I'm feeling my cup, but it's still half empty. I feel like a pessimist. She thinks she in love, but she only half met me. She don't get the sentiment. I still have a door open for you on your way. I'll still be a gentleman. And I'm too far gone. Don't wanna hear about what you are on. Lately, I'm just feeling out my mind. Maybe I got each other lie. I make it look effortless. I make it look 
effortless <sighs> Tell you what, I don't even preface it <sighs> Make it look effortless <sighs> Alright, that was, you know, what it need to be Not too much of it Quick little, you know, vibe real quick and out of there I like that Way too many friends, it's always a problem Having way too many friends is always a problem Start calling my blood if you want to make a mess Don't call you enough, not as much as I intend I, I don't say it enough, but I think you in the end My delay a few offense on the day, it just depends I got way too many friends, I got way too many friends I got way too many friends, I got way too many I can't tell you what it's really about Eight times out of ten I got way too many friends I got way too many friends I got way too many friends I got way too many I got way too many friends I got way too many friends I got way too many friends I got way too many I got way too many friends I got way too many friends I got way too many friends I got way too many I got way too many friends I got way too many friends I got way too many friends I got way too many How to put something on my butt It's gotta be tucked into my pants like it was nothing, I got a judgment in advance Done and dusted, you cannot touch this Cause I'm reluctant when I dance It's so similar, a visitor who never got a chance I can't tell him that I miss him now Make it one and done Did it fit, I took a different route Make it one on one In the thick, I had to figure out If I jumped the gun, couldn't resist I had to pin it down Till I wasn't done And I Stop calling my bluff if you wanna make a mess Don't call you enough, not as much as I intend I, I don't say it enough, but I think you in it I got way too many friends, I got way too many friends, I got way too many friends, I got way too many. I got way too many friends, I got way too many friends, I got way too many friends, I got way too many friends. Yo. Um Let me see if you're here. It's a pretty long it's you you get the white crib. I don't want to say it because I got my camera on. Um, is this you making this left right here? Wait, I hear you, but you're in the wrong driver. Hold on. Over here. Yeah, you're right here. I knew Arbor would end up at the wrong damn spot. Okay. Songs in. Couple songs up, I mean. You might like this type of stuff. <laughs> Alright, that way too many friends song. It was decent, you know what I mean? I did get a little distracted, so all my free time I will get back to it. But we got Arbor here with us chat real quick. He has to tell me a cool story, but we're gonna bang this reaction out real quick. That's cool. Hold on. They were telling me about some guy. Quadeca, I guess. Everybody's talking about him. Um, and they're like, you gotta check out his album, Scrapyard. So I'm like, eh, mixed feelings about it. It's some shit we would see in the club. Probably at uh, what's that shit called? Cornerstone? This is the type of shit you would probably hear. <laughs> uh, what's the shit we can go to a jersey with the two corners? Midland, that's it, that's it. Yeah. Stay into the van, had to go through the back. Gang so and in and out, each city didn't even know I'm back. Yeah, true, I play with the money and you pitch like my name so loud. Yeah, true, that's enough to make somebody disappear when I say time out. Yeah. Guess who? Guess who? Guess who? Heard it they done? Yes, you. How about this one? Here's the next clue. Okay. Looking so tall, next two. All of those odds. Oh, bet two. Tell me who's that one in the middle of the night in your head that you never slept through? Yeah. 
so just walk in the bed of my options and reel in my confidence set. Brand new collection, it cost me killing it, tucking it, killing it, cost me to make. And I got lost, I'm rebuilding, I popped down the ceiling and made it a living space. Dodging and knock off the penis, my drop box made this, that shit a hospitable place. I, I, okay, I just walked in, now you caught in the act. If you heard the rest of these songs, you would not expect this. So you want my opinion? This, this is straight up just honestly terrible. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm, no, kidding. I'm, kidding. I'm kidding. No, it's good. I like it. It's I've never heard of something like this before. This is something new. Like I like it. It's he's on that like that like uh Mike's th this sounds like some like Mike Stud type rap right now, but he was not on this before. He was on some like I don't know, Lil Yachty, let's start here. You don't know Wyland, but like some just like different type of funky pop ish kind of stuff. This is more like rap. Remind me, go ahead and take your shot, take it in line yeah. You know you can take my spot, I'm staying in my beat If you put me in a box, uh Double check, cause it gotta be a hundred miles deep Yeah, they think I change a lot, but I promise I'm weak Even if the bounce of double takes out my ID Cause I drew away before I even turned 19 Get a mob at the in and out in a dry clean Dropping tapes like I couldn't figure out a crime scene My career fucking weird, can't even define me When it's scared, still here, they said I was naive Niggas were they pushing buttons, but never rewind me Cause they couldn't tell a masterpiece from a tight beat Which glorified interns in the side seat Bitch, what? <laughs> Damn, I'm packed out with the fans Never backed out on my plans Like I maxed out my fans It was her turn and lied to me But she just passed out at the chance I can't be mad about a couple of ends Okay, okay uh. Guess who? Walked into the vein, had to go through the back uh. Guess who? In and in out, you see they didn't even know that Yeah, true, I play with the money You pitch them and they sell a lot Yeah, true, that's enough to make somebody disappear When I say time that I just think like Yeah, I think it's pretty catchy. It's it's catchy, it is. I just don't like the tangent that he goes off on. Just for, yeah, like, like yeah, it was good, but that has a million streams already. Oh no, this thing is streaming real well. It's streaming real well. Look at the beginning. It's doing like real well. You know what I'm saying? I don't know who this guy is. I've never heard of him before. Like Quadeca. I've heard of break ins. Quadeca, yeah, but I've never heard this guy. And so he's got all these, but like I will, I won't, I won't, act, I won't sit here and act like he's not artistic and creative as fuck. He definitely is, but this is just like you know, everybody's moving into this new era, like this, this like I don't know, it's kind of like I call it this like funky pop. That's what I call it. Guess who? Guess who? Sweet. It's a whole bunch of songs that I can, to an extent, hear in the club. But not just like yeah, you know regular club, like, like not. Copy. He's like trying to copy like Playboy Cardi. No, nah, not Cardi, not Cardi, yeah, not Cardi. Is. This is this is some shit that he made though, right? Cardi, uh, Cardi would definitely do some like next level shit, but this is more like Wildland. But you got to hear Wildland to know. It's like upbeat house music kind. Yeah, this is house music. Uh -huh. Some white. Music. Yeah. Guess who? Guess who? It's not what? It's not what? I don't know. I have, no, like I said, I do not know this guy at all. Never heard of him. And I'm ten songs into his album. <laughs> Under my skin. Let's see. Right. It's not bad. I've definitely heard worse. But then it gets up like this, like. That's what I meant by genre? That's what I meant by earlier. I was like earlier. Like that uh, like air. Uh, I don't even know. This is considered I don't even know. But that's what I meant earlier when I was like, if you heard all the other songs, you would not be expecting this at all. And you could tell because that one's streaming really well compared to the other. But it could possibly have been out before, but yeah. <laughs>
some like you know some 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 movie soundtrack could be a love story, could be a sad story. I could see it being a movie about like old people for some reason. I don't know. Yeah, but it just, I see my grandma walking around the house listening to this. Yeah, you know he's he's being he's going he's going all around the map. I guess being versatile with the album, but. It's like, I don't know. Yeah, I can't go from the song I just listened to to this. It throws me off. It throws me off. Like, this is definitely for somebody, you know, that sad little soul that's out there all alone in this world. It's definitely going to fuck them up and smack them right in the chest. I get that, but I can't really get this. Yeah, we're not going to really continue this one, y'all. It's a little too slow. I'm getting a little sad and teary at the eye listening to this. Being yourself. I can't just... Yeah, I can just stop the album. <laughs> Being yourself. Let's see. Let's see. What's crazy is I just did all the like viral so I can get to this and be like, all right. Oh, I want to I want to chill and see you can see my friend. I want to find every light so I see me to do that. Three minutes of this, too. <laughs> Chat, y'all meditating to this? That's a good. That's a good take, though. That's what I would do. I could definitely sit back. Like, like I said earlier, like, like it's white noise to me. Like it's music that you just, it's just playing around the house. You know what I'm saying? It definitely suits that. 100%. But after just listening to Yeet, Ken Carson, DDG, Cemetery, this definitely turns me down. That's fine. I guess that's the point. I want you to do your job. You want the We want you to do your job. I switch. I give you the end. I wish. I wish, I wish you could be yourself. 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 I wish. What do you think? I mean, the beginning was like relaxing, and then the end is like, like I think you said it best with the other song. It sounds like something you'd hear like at the end of like a chick flick, like at a, at the end of a movie. Yeah, I don't know. It's not really something that would, would catch. It's not something you hear on the radio. Yeah, I, don't, I mean, but which is which is fine. Not everything is for the radio, you know. But at the same time, it's still like this is just this is just slow. It was just slow. I'm not looking for something slow. Um, but I can, yeah, I'm not looking for something slow. I'm looking for something that fucking hits. Like, guess who? I forgot to like it to a bump. 
You tried that thing where you're human. All right. It's time to give up no grip. on being human. Yeah, well done. It's time to give up on being human. It's time to give up on being human. So no, it's not to give up on being human. Like, I don't know. You know the woke community, how everybody thinks that we're just like these beings walking around in these like we're like gods, but we're just walking around in these these costumes that make us human. But we're really not humans. We're just like you know, this this thought of a human, you know that shit. I don't know. I guess maybe that could be what he's talking about. Oh, like labels. You know, people people just think like we're not who we think we are. We're more than that. I don't know. Could possibly be what he's trying to say. This is a hot take. But we're not. Though. I could be dead wrong. I think. I think. I think people think they're, they're. I think most people think that they're a lot more than what they think they are. But I think, you know, at the end of the day, in the grand scheme of things, like, you gotta shoot, you're gotta you going to die, you know, no one's going to remember you. Unless you do something, you're that 1.1% 1. 1 that does something big, you know, you're just another dot. But that's the reality, but you're, you're at, but at the, at the same time, it's special, it's a gift. You get to live. And when you, your life is yours, right? And right. you get to dictate how you want to perceive it and how you want to live it, right? right? So I guess that's what he means. I don't know. Well, I, I assumed he, was, he wanted to kill himself. It's time to give up on being human. I think, I'm thinking he wants to fall. Himself. It could be that as well. No? It could be that as well. It could be. Let's see. It's four minutes, so I don't know. I can't listen to him be all teary on a fucking song for four minutes. Yeah, I like that he's all Yeah. <laughs> the voice sounds pretty raw and shit. But just... Psychedelics. I think he, I think he's trying talking about having a trip and then while you're tripping, dying and then being born again. Mm. That's like a big message you get from from psychedelic drugs. Mm. So. You might have did something, Arbor. <laughs> he's out, Sam. Yeah, we know. Could be you could have hit that. You could have did that. I'm gonna be something. Try my best I did.
Okay, too many sounds. I get it though. Could be what you were talking about though. I think it is. Tripping, think going out bad, and coming back like, in the person. Why else? What else would it be about? Because like, you know, what's crazy? What this guy's music, I can tell he probably dabbles. Either he does psychedelics or he dabbles, and I dabbled in psychedelics. And I got that message when you do it. You know. I'm still too scared. Psychedelics, to psychedelics could could like I don't know, they could really help you out. Some people use psychedelics as different therapy. Absolutely. Got the percent that I use them since they, they they know the dosage and they the, and last, they, the know? last the last couple psychedelics I did fucking helped me out. Bro. Really? Absolutely helped heal my mind. How to how to help heal your mind? Mm-hmm. It does. That's exactly what is it's his death. I'll tell you, how did it help heal your mind? I I feel like exactly what he's talking about in this in the song death death you forget about your trauma and then you build a new person that's what it is so that's one thing but it also it's also a proven fact that certain psychedelics they can heal like the neurotransmitters in your head too i'm gonna take a whole eighth and go oh, don't eat eight eight <laughs> you guys don't eat eight microdose i, I recommend microdosing, microdosing is good. i'm gonna try it out i'm gonna try it out okay you try that thing oh, you gotta be in a good place mentally to take I feel like if you it's take them that, in a bad place mentally, it could fuck you fuck up. That. It could fuck you up even more. But if oh. you're like on your way up and you're like improving, improving, it just. Boom, I should do it now. Up. Now that I'm in that new house high, yeah, you know, you like that you new should, home you, high, you, where everything you, you, I finally you, packed and everything. I should you like half a tab of acid. Half a tab? You have yeah. one? I don't have any. <laughs> Give me right now. I'll pop it on the stream. <laughs> yo, like, yo, Bob the stream, fucking tweaking and geeking, not even knowing where my keyboard's at. All right, let's get the guide though. Two more songs. Yourself a new listeners, uh, Cordeca. You're welcome. Probably will. My love songs don't sing seven times well. How long can this speak for itself? Bunch of I got you to won't hurt me. How I describe you when you're not around. And I'll find you a place in the crowd. I'll be myself. I like the drums on this. I mean, I mean the guitar on this. All right, that was a little sad vibe. I like that song. If I was depressed, I'd cry to it. I don't think his songs. I think I thought his song was depression, but after healing these songs, it's like, yeah, it's mental health problems. But I think his music is more about healing than anything else. That's my message. Could possibly. Texas Blue with Kevin Abstract. I've definitely heard Kevin Abstract before. I'm just trying to remember where, where exactly. I'm next to you, am I complex to you? Scratches on your back, the sun peeking through. Sagging baggy jeans, it's ready to preview. Feel the wind coming in, are you gonna let it I'll be honest, you like movies more than I do. Are they 
peace in the jungle On your covers, on your covers Seeing you in ashes Photos and boxes of matches The button Texas blue, purple tea in the cup, green was an indica, new pair of dreams, we burned it all up, ash on the sheets, you're making me suffer, what will it take to slow you down, that silent treatment gets a little loud, Like Tizo Touchdown should have been on this album somewhere, some way, somehow. Tizo Touchdown belongs on this album. Um, it's five minutes. <laughs> Texas Blue gave me movie outro vibes. You know, definitely a good song to, uh, you know, end an album. Might have been a little too long for my liking, but then again, it's just white noise to me, especially at this point. But I think Arbor had a point that the, uh, the album definitely has this, like, replenishing feel yeah, <laughs> to it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> It is refreshing, especially these days. Whoa, you made me sick, niggas. You got here. It is, you know, it is refreshing to see artists try new things. And it is refreshing to myself to be listening to all types of music so I can, you know, build a tolerance and expand my palate and appreciate more. I don't think I would have liked an album like this two years ago. Hell, and I would have had zero interest in it. I would not have made it halfway through. But it did, you know, it, uh, um, yeah. 
I will say that. But I won't be listening to this album on my free time. I'll be honest. This is 100% reaction purposes. I don't really think, I don't, yeah, I don't really see myself getting any more invested. I don't know about Arbor. He'll let you know in a second. I mean, yeah, I think this is something that um, on my free time I'm going to replay. I think it's pretty good. I like his use of instruments. I mean, me personally, um, when it comes to music, I have a wide variety of music that I listen to. When I'm with this guy, I only listen to hip hop because that's what he likes. So I like, put you on the mad yeah, shit though. Yeah, you put, you I put you on the mad. Matter of fact, hold up, cause he about to, he trying to cook me right here, chat. Hold up, I gotta stand my ground. Hold up, this motherfucker no. When I come around, yeah, I got yeah. some new on the aux, and it's been like that for years, bro. Facts, but that's true. I do bring hip hop to the table. Yeah. So, but when I'm with him, I mostly just uh, listen to hip hop. But for me personally, like when I'm on my own time and I'm on in my by myself in my car driving, I listen to fucking everything. Red Hot Chili Peppers. I was just about to mention that. I'll be like, this nigga be playing Red Hot Chili Peppers. I'll be like, yo, turn this off, bro. Even though I listen to him too, but I'm trying to listen to Young Boy on this ride to the club, not. Fucking this guy, yeah, these well, guys. <laughs> Very wide variety of music that I like. You know? And how do you feel about this? I think it's good. I think it's pretty good. I think you should play me one of his better songs. I don't even know one of his better songs. Like Get, when, when, when you came, when you came, we were listening to like the better one. Gotcha. Like that was like my favorite one on the album. I ain't even gonna lie. Actually, I like the, that last song more than I like that. The, one that you played. the Texas Blue? I like, yeah, I like Texas Blue. It, it, it had that, like, you know, kick your feet up and drink a brewski vibe to it. You know what I mean? On the front porch, for real. Yeah, but I think, like, his his combining, like, with instruments and the melody and everything is just on point. I just think it was a little too long. Yeah, five minutes is long. It's a little too long. Like, but yeah, like, it's just a little too yeah, long. I'm, I'm, I'm not listening. Time. Uh, yeah, I'm not listening to that just like, uh, let me go turn that Texas Blue on. It's more so like, oh, Texas Blue played earlier today. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I wouldn't turn it off, but I wouldn't turn it off. Gotcha. Respectfully. Yeah, what would you rate the album? I would give it, you know, as far as production, I'm rating it like, nah. In total, I'm giving the project like a six and a half, but like four, 4.5 of that comes from the production. Like you were saying, like 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 you were saying, the use of it, good. Yeah, yeah. Like like the majority of it was the use of instruments and like the way he you know put put yeah, this yeah. shit together. I like that, you know, because it definitely kept me going. Because at some points he's just like crying on the track. Yeah, he's just like, he's like a little too like calm with the vocals. But what he was, what his vocals was doing with the beat, they did for sure. For sure. So yeah, this is that Quadeca, and with Kevin Abstract. Scrapyard album. No, no, no. Not with Kevin Abstract. This is just Quadeca. Scrapyard. The album. Um gives me JPEG Mafia vibes, like I said, Wineland vibes. Uh seen Lil Yachty dib and dab into some stuff like this. I did like Lil Yachty's version of this type of music. This type of house music more. You know? But yeah, Breakins did pretty good on the project too. Uh, I'm not sure which one was Breakins, but if he was who I thought he was on this a la carte feature, I think that was pretty dope. I might, on my free time, come back to this one. If they have videos for any of these, let me know which ones I did not watch. But yeah, I'm out this. Go lock on me on kick. You're not doing this. You're in a kick. Peace.